Sri Lanka will call Platinum One a landmark. Only 70 will call it home. Because the address and where you live matters. Platinum One. The finest address in Colombo. Now the fourth estate of the media is only accountable to the citizenry. Across the world, provision has been made in fundamental law for the freedom of the media, a tenet of true democracy. We've got to know whether or not... From the brave reporting of the Watergate scandal which led to the resignation of a US president to more recent revelations which have shaken governments, the fourth estate has served to hold to account to society their rulers and their wrongs. Globally, the free media plays a major role in providing a platform for investigative journalists and serves to protect them while delivering their message to the people. Fundamentally, the freedom of the press and freedom of opinion is a very important pillar of democracy and it varies throughout the world from democratic countries to dictatorial totalitarian countries there is as you know a west world press freedom index sri lanka comes as 162 the last is 179 where eritrea from africa comes so we have a long way to go before we can be amongst the countries that maintain press freedom. In Sri Lanka, investigative journalists have attracted the ire of those who would seek to abuse their powers on countless occasions. From threats to assassinations, this open flouting of democratic principles has caused many to go into exile. As with all cases in Sri Lanka, such as corruption and bribery, our laws are in fact very good laws, they're robust laws. The problem is in the implementation. So there are a number of compromises that people make on press freedom, which uh, unfortunately affects the people, because the people are not being told the truth. And the truth is what makes people free. 